This guy doesn't show... Wait. I'm talking about standing right here. Oh, I'm still in range anyway. Oh, that's annoying. It's It almost feels like we have to take down at least these guys. If I want to safely get to him. Yeah, it kind of seems that way. Did we... We crashed? Aw, oh, don't do this game. Or stream, Twitch, whatever. Why does the internet want to be like this today? Is it just one of those days? It might be. What's going on? Is it just one of those days? We'll keep an eye on it, but... Uh, <clears throat> I... It's nothing I can do. That's, that's the annoying part. It's not something... <laughs> It's just the, the internet, you know? The internet's being the internet today. Whether it's on Twitch side or my side, I don't know which one it is. Yeah, we're just gonna have Orson get this kill. If I want to safely get to this guy without getting anyone else's range, I have to take these guys out. Or I send Orson in. That is the other option. I send Orson in and have him take the, these two hits. And then have Kyle come in here. That is the other option. And try to how many how many uses do I have? Twenty-eight. Twenty-eight uses. What do we think? Still probably gonna take two hits per like with Orson it'll probably take two per hit. So two, four, six, eight, ten at the very least. Twelve, fourteen. This will probably be seventeen at the very least. <sighs> you know what? We might have to use Orson for a little bit. I think we need to avoid these guys. Yeah, let's use Orson. We gave Kyle some levels. We gave him two levels. That's already good. Five damage versus eleven. So 
So, here's the thing. Normally, this guy could attack me, but I, this guy's not going to move. So, I think I won't get attacked by him. I will, however, get attacked by this monk. How much damage? Yeah, we're still talking to. How much movement do you have? Five? Yeah, we're we're better off using Orson. He has a Volinary. Was GTA 5 on Switch? I am not sure. I mean, maybe. It could have been... A, if it wasn't, it could have been a cloud version. Why? I think... Was that a crit? Alright... How much damage are we talking here? Still talking two. Two hits. Um, your speed is six. Your speed is six. We don't double. 16 damage. So 13 damage. We can actually have Kyle go up against this guy. It's two hits anyway. Yeah, no matter what, it's going to be two hits. We have Kyle get this kill. Maybe even this one too. Alright, um... It will be best for me to back out. have Kyle stand right here. Because I still want to feed him EXP. Okay, we can go right here. Maybe I should have healed first, I don't know. Okay. Let me check my defense. Defense of nine. Uh, we're talking seven damage. Okay. We'll be fine. Friend sent me a meme about people on previous gens, PS4, Xbox One, asking if GTA 6 will be on those consoles. The comments, obviously, we were making jokes about it. One dude asked if they'll be on Switch. Ah. I see. Um. Hold on. Let's take a quick look. It looks like it never made it to Switch. Oh, I think I know why I got confused. I think the defendant, uh, the GTA 3 trilogy made it to Switch, but not 5. Yeah. And honestly, I figured if it was going to get to Switch anyway, it would have been a... It would have been a, uh cloud version so if we we're probably gonna have to attack this archer it's gonna take two hits no matter what we do we want to stay out of range of this guy because we want to make sure that uh, Orson get, deals with him you stay out of range of you as much as possible we We'll be dealing with this guy. Uh, okay, how much damage can you deal? 13 damage. 
9 defense. So 4, four damage. Okay. We could do this. Try, watching the PS4 explode, trying to load GTA 6. Yeah. That would be the case. Uh, actually, I got a question about GTA. So GTA 3 did a lot of... Uh, let's just say 0.5 games where you, they use the same engine, but they made different games. Like... Uh, like New Vegas or whatever. Did GTA 5 get any of those types of games, or was it just GTA 5 and nothing else? Alright, I want Orson to get over here. We're gonna get forward in position. Next, let's check to see how Kyle does against this guy. It's still going to be a two-hit KO. He can kill me if he hits me. So what we are going to do is we are going to stand right here. We're going to heal up. Just GTA 5 and nothing else. I see. Let's set you here. Uh, no, let's, let's keep you there for now. Red Dead Redemption 2 and Max Payne 3. Oh, are you saying they use the same engine as GTA 5? Oh, so instead of making... GTA 5.5 games. They... they uh, Okay, so we got a point in speed, but that's it. Uh, we got Re Red Dead Redemption 2 and Max Payne 3. Okay. In some ways that counts, but I feel like they probably did that with other stuff. Um... Okay. Is there any way we could deal with the armor unit without getting this guy close? No. So, if we want to deal with this armor unit, we have to either get a range of him, or rush in. And that's not a good idea. Similar so GTA 3, San Andreas being used for manhunt and bully. Right, right, right. I knew about bully. I had a feeling they probably used it. So just keep an eye on. Okay. Uh, one thing I'm going to check. Reinforcements. They would probably be on this tile, but maybe we can block it. Um, okay, let's see if we can find something about reinforcements. I'm not seeing anything about reinforcements. I don't think this one has reinforcements. They probably didn't do reinforcements because you can't restock on things. Theoretically, Manhunt is in the 3D area of GTA. I don't know if I heard of Manhunt. Okay, how many, use how many uses do we have left? 18, ooh. Two, four, six, eight. So that's at ten right here. We'll be at, with taking out this guy, we would have seven uses left over. Let's avoid this guy. I think it'll be in our best interest to have Orson rush in. I think that would be better.
We have so few uses left. Um, we'll do that. Okay, let's take a look. It's, yeah, that's going to take three hits. As I thought. You know, maybe we can get this guy... <sighs> it's a very controversial game since you are the main character of a prisoner who is forced to take part in this. Oh, wow. I mean, it's brutal ways to sacrifice. Right. Get your freedom. Sa that, out of all the things GTA, uh, Rockstar has done, that probably is the most controversial, controversial one, is it? Isn't it? And I feel like I've only, every, you know, I only hear about GTA controversy. Uh... Especially with the infamous hot coffee mod thing. Uh, you know what? With two mages here, we may want to actually heal Orson. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna do that. Stay right there. Yeah, I'm staying out of range of this mage. Okay, if I go in, let's say I attack this guy. Yeah, it's gonna be a two hit KO. Let's get this guy weakened. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to use Orson for the rest of the chapter, maybe. Maybe we could give Kyle a couple kills, like, with from the mages, but I don't know. The, this guy was the big, the big problem. Orson, I could have really used the crit on that first hit. <laughs> Save a use. Yeah. damage. I am, okay, I'm curious. Two hit KO. I don't know why I backed all the way out. Still two hit KO. Your attack would be 16. Your, uh, it would it would be a two hit KO no matter what. We could probably feed both of these kills to to Orson. Oh, they're both in the same spot, pretty much. What's your movement? One, two. I could stand right here and one of them will attack me. However, I don't want that to happen. Because it will attract the mage. Let's go down here. Let's have to go down here. 
Okay, they're not going to move back. Let's move Orson here. If I stand right here, I can get attacked. So I at least need to go here. Alright, let's see what we're looking at. If I get hit, I take 10 damage. If I get hit, I take six damage. Exactly enough. Are you kidding me? All right. Volinary. You know what? Let's... No, not give. Trade. Volinary. There we go. My is cult following. Was it still is banned in multiple countries? Yeah, that sounds familiar. PS2 has the uncensored version. PC doesn't have that option without mods. Really? Huh. So now at Kyle's HP, he should be able to get the KO and survive both hits. If that were to happen. I want to make sure this guy's out of here. Kyle, come on. <laughs> Every time they've gotten a crit, it's on the second hit. Alright, well... I guess one thing I'll do is I'll have Orson stand here, and maybe this guy will attack Orson? Maybe? No. I had a feeling. What do you have? Steel blade? Okay. One, two, three, four, five. I, uh, he's standing in a pillar. I don't like that. Luckily, or uh, Orson can just tank this guy. If we stand... Okay, no. The fact that the Steam version that's currently for sale... That's currently on for sale, I would recommend. Not to recommend buy. Okay. So you're saying if I were to go with that game, go with the PS2 version? then assuming it's not like uber, overly expensive I don't know like of anything I guess anything Rockstar has made I feel like Manhunt to me as someone who has no knowledge of anything that would be the hardest one to recommend we can have Kyle go in. There we go. That's way better. I like those odds. Alright. We are probably going to have Orson take down the boss. If I were to stand here, what are we looking at? I would have to do five hits. And he gets healed in between attacks. Okay, this, this is what has to happen. We have to use Orson. Do 
you truly think you could take us with those numbers? Imbecile! You learned the error of your ways! Okay. He's also not going to move, so we can start... What's your range? Let's get right here. We are this close. We don't have that many uses. So, we have five uses left. Here's the issue. I could try to attack him right now. And I have two shots. However, if I miss both of them... Okay, no, I can rescue. We're going for it. We're going for it. There we go. Lord Tirando. Tirado. It can't be. We were... Were we merely pawns? I don't care. <laughs> Alright. We could take your stuff. And Orson has no items. We have four uses of the iron sword left over. And we made it. <laughs> oh, wow. I wasn't sure. Uh, they haven't. Uh, so instead of the norm, normal game, they posted a pirated version that has those built in anti piracy security that breaks the game. Oh, or bricks the game. Oh, I see. They have an interest despite being a problem for three to four months. So. We've secured the entire castle. You were brilliant, Prince Ephraim. What a plan. What a battle. Kyle, you and Orson did all the work. Ephraim and Ford just stood back and did nothing. I estimated at least half of the enemy troops are on the field. We took the castle, but we didn't have manpower to hold it in a siege. There's no point in lingering here. Let's continue on to Grotto Keep. Prince Ephraim, things have taken a turn for the worse. I took a look around the castle perimeter. We're surrounded. What? Grotto sent reinforcements. So quickly? What should we do? We must escape. So you captured Renval, have you? And with such a small force. Impressive. You've earned your reputation, I must say. I quite admire your work. I take it you're the leader of this pack, the misguided Prince Ephraim. I am. The Gen I'm General Valter, the Moonstone of Grotto's Imperial Army. Catching up uh, to you has caused me no small amount of trouble. We've reduced your wretched home of Rene to ruin. And yet, your and your little band of bravos continue to be a thorn in our side. But that all ends here. We'll see. You claim you've taken the capital of Rene. Tell me, how did you know I would attack Renval? <laughs> Patience! You'll have your answer soon enough. Now, be good lads, and drop your weapons, will you? Prince Ephraim, let's attack. Listen to me, Ephraim. You're a smart man. You know it's futile to fight me. You cannot win. You cannot escape. Accept the reality of your situation, and surrender to me. Surrender? <laughs> That's right. If you do, I'll let you live. I hold your life in the palm of my hand. Do not test my good humor. Now come over, bend your knee, and beg for your life. Show me how Rene dogs grovel. I think not. What? You said your name was Volter, didn't you? Well, I'm sorry, Volter, but I don't have time to waste playing games with you. So we're gonna knock you lots of, about a bit, and then make our way out of here. Fool! Have you gone mad? 
Do you truly believe you can fight your way past my wyvern knights? Watch and see. I don't pick fights I can't win. Cow, Ford, are you ready? My life has been yours since the moment I took my shiv chivalric vows. It's moments like these that keep me by your side, my prince. What idiotic wrenches you are. Prepare yourself to be destroyed utterly. We break to the east. Go! Well, we managed to do that with only using the iron sword. We did have to use Orson quite a bit, but that was going to happen anyway. So, what? okay. Our items. We have the guiding ring. We can put that in storage for now. We won't need it at the moment. Erica could use another iron sword. We're fine on healing for now. You could use the one, just in case. You're fine. You have plenty. You have plenty. Iron Axe. Seth has an Iron Sword. Actually, yeah, we... Oh, we might use Joshua. You know what? Let's just... Let's just do that. Calm doesn't need it. So what do we got in here? Yeah, it's just the same as last time. Same shop, and let me double check. Oh. Let me double check the this one. Well, I can't use the torch staff, nor the restore staff. Yeah, nothing here. Is there anything I can sell? Hold on. We can use that. We can't sell that. Keep those, keep this. Sure. Okay, yeah. We're fine. Alright. Let's move on to the next chapter. Erica suppresses her feelings of unease and continues to search for her brother. Passing through Ser Seraphiu, the group crosses into the Grotto Empire. From here forward, there is no doubt that they are walking through hostile territory. In hopes of avoiding unnecessary trouble, Erica and company head for a, s a sparsely populated region of Grotto. However, it is too late. Their movements are already being tracked. <laughs> so tell me, you have asserted Erica's whereabouts, have you not? I have. I've sent some of our men to follow the princess as she left, as she fled Seraphiu. They tell me Erica and her friends will be coming this way shortly. Our ambush is ready and ra waiting. There is no way they can escape. Like rats in a sack, as they say. <laughs> Very good. Won't that wenched Voltaire be delighted? Now about this Princess Erica. I hear she's quite a handful. They say her paladin withstood Voltaire's lance. Tell me, Novala, are you certain you can handle this assignment? Don't worry, everything is under control. I brought along a certain something from Rene. It will be it will negate what a whatever futile resistance they offer. <laughs> Pray it goes as you say. Very well. Do what you must. I must return to the capital. Will you not stay to see how Erica looks in captivity? Unlike two other layabouts I know, I do not have such time to waste. I have much to do for our master. A mountain of tasks await, for, await me. My time is far too precious to waste on the likes of, the, of that royal whelp. Truffles such as these are best left in the hands of servants such as you. Yes, of course. Then travel well freakish old man. You should have watched. You might have learned something. I will capture the princess, and I will replace you at, at our master's side. You will stew in regret, and I will enjoy every moment. Oh, Fog of War chapter. <laughs> princess Erica of Renee. 
Accept your fate. You have nowhere to flee. What? Who are you? And where, where did you come from? You're as beautiful as I heard. And you're even wearing your bracelet. I suppose we should begin there. Would you surrender your lovely little trinket? My bracelet? Why do you want it? My, His Majesty desires it. That's the reason enough. Once I present it to him, he will make me a general, and I will be famous. Come, hand it over. Do it quickly, and I'll leave you alive. Princess Erica, you'll do no such thing. Of course not. Obedience will save your pain. Save you pain. You came all this way to aid Prince Ephraim, have you not? A fool's errand. Ephraim fell before the Empire's might. As we speak, he wastes away in a cell in Renval, meeking away meekly awaiting his execution. My brother! A lie! A pitiful worm like you can never beat my brother! Bah! Protest all you like. It does not change the truth. Ephraim has lost. And it was Grotto that defeated him. Who else would it be? You're not going to acquiesce, are you? Very well. Bring me the child. Help me! Uh, look familiar? She's a citizen of your precious Renee. Now give me the bracelet. Do it, or the child dies. No, please. You win. But I must have your word the child will, will suffer no harm. Princess, wait. That bracelet. It's not worth a child's life. Forgive me, Seth. Yes, there could be no mistake in it. Next, your weapons. Take them off and hand them over. No. Surrendering our weapons would be ter tantamount to suicide. You demand too much of us. I see years of peace and idleness have not dulled the wits of all Renee's knights. Well then, my hostage has no more use to me, does she? Ah, uh, such a waste. Wait a moment. I have... I just had a delicious idea. Have you heard of the giant spiders prowling around this region? They'd ap appreciate a nice hot meal, wouldn't you agree? Y you can't! No! <laughs> this will be a delight to watch. These fools will curse the day they were born into Rene. Why? Why would you? How could you do such a thing? This is war! There, there are no rules here. In war, you can do anything! Anything! You curs of Rene have lost. Your idiotic ravings mean nothing. Enough! Hold your tongue! Wh what? I... We the people of Rene have long honored our allegiance with the Grotto Empire. And you have invaded without warning. You ravaged our land and killed my father. Even then, I told myself I must not hate the grotto or her people. If I gave into my hate, the bond between our lands would be for lost forever. I refuse to hate. Instead, I live for the day our nations would know peace again. But if this is grotto's true face, if you could extinguish Rene without pity, Without remorse. If this is the case, there is no room in my heart for forgiveness. Impudent girl! Do you expect your words to save your countrymen? They will not. Your beloved people will all die as you will. <laughs> if you must curse someone, curse your dear princess. Help someone! Cry! Scream! <laughs> Are we going to get eaten? We're going to be fine. Someone will help rescue us. Would you look at these muscles? I had no idea how stronger I've gotten. Why, I bet I could take on en my dad or just about anyone. I knew if I worked at it, I'd become a great warrior. So, are we making him a fighter just like his dad? Or are we making him a pirate? I think Pirate's more interesting, personally. Uh, you know what? I think we may need to look at... Not necessary... Like... I, I think we need to look at, like, stack caps, maybe, and stack gross for here. Um... That might be better.
Oh, let's see if we can find. Let's see if I can find something. Um. You know what? I might need to go here. Yeah, sorry. We're gonna sit. We're gonna stay in here for a second <laughs> because I have not fully decided which one does more crit damage. That is a good point. I think the berserker at the very end has a higher chance of critting. Now let me let me look. I might uh, I need to type in like job classes. That might be more important. The job the job class. Um, classes. Actually, I put a look up characters too, just in case. All right. So we want to look at. No, not rec not that recruit. We want journeymen, okay. Oh, I didn't know this about Super Trainee. So, Super Trainee, you could go to Journeyman two, uh, 2, and then it goes to Journeyman 3, which has a plus 15 crit rate once you get it to its final job class. That's interesting. Uh, okay, but... We don't have access to that anyway, so fighter or pirate? Okay. Pirate can cross seas. Can become a berserker or a warrior. The fighter become a warrior or a hero. Heroes are good. Heroes are really good. However, if we go into the berserker, we can have a plus 15 crit rate and we could cross mountains and seas. The warrior gets access to a bow. That gives us a range, since we're only using iron stuff. We won't have the boost in terms of, uh, like, say, using a crit axe, a killing axe, but. And let me look at Hero very quick. Where is it? Hero. Yeah, I could use swords and axes, but nothing special. Our hero's good with iron. Let me look at Hero specifically. Let's see if we can find... Hero's base stats in FE8. Let's see... 22 HP, 6 six strength, 9 or 10 skill, 10 or 11 speed, 8 or 6 defense, 2 or 3 res, 6 move, 10 or 9 con. So really the big thing is 6 strength. That's the big thing. Let me pull up Warrior and Berserker. The benefit of being a hero is we have access to swords. That is a benefit. It gives us two options. With warrior here, we have access to bows. But the warrior has a base strength of eight. So the warrior is stronger than the hero. What's our speed? Speed of six. The hero has a speed of ten or uh, ten or eleven. So we're trading speed for strength. With the warrior, we are less likely to double, but we have more power. But the hero is more likely to double. I don't know. The berserker. Let's see. We have a strength of seven. So it's the in between. The Berserker is not as strong as the Warrior, but stronger than the Hero. The Berserker also has a speed of 7. It is faster than the Warrior, but not as fast as the Hero. So the Berserker is the in-between, plus it gets the 15 crit rate, and it can cross mountains and seas. But we only have access to axes. 
That's all we have. Honestly, I feel... I would think that the access to better crit, and it's not the weakest, will probably out uh, outperform the other two. That is my guess. What do you think, chat? What do you think, chat? You know what? Let's also look up Ross specifically. See his growth growth rates. So let's see. Uh, so he has a 50% growth in strength. Speed is 30. So he's less likely to get speed. But strength is a 50-50. I don't fully know how the, the growth rates affect... Uh, Wait, are these girls? No, those are base stats. And maybe stack. I mean, we could look at stat caps, but I don't think that's going to help. Oh, growth rates. There's a growth rate table here. That's probably better right now. So we already know that Warrior's the strongest but the slowest. Uh, and has access to bows. So that gives you a ranged weapon. Heroes have access to swords. And they are faster. No range. And Berserker is the in-between, only axes, but plus 15 crit, can cross mountains and seas. The growth rate of heroes. Uh, there's a 30% strength boost uh, percentage and a 20% speed growth. I, I don't fully know how this works. Do you add those on top of Ross's growth, growth rates? So for strength, for example, Ross has a 50%. So if you add the hero's 30%, is that 80% chance to boost strength? Is that how it works? I don't fully understand how that works. Damage, I would say, matters more than weapon range when it comes to iron weapons. I think I agree. But now we are asking being able to double... Being able to double with the hero with the extra weapon type with swords. I don't think bow range is going to be that helpful. Bows are not that strong as it is. They're not as good against flyers as it is. And most flyers have lances anyway, so an axe will do the job. So the benefit of the hero is that it won't it probably won't be as strong, but it will definitely more likely double. And you have swords. With the berserker though, we get that plus 15 crit, but all we have is axes. This is really hard to say. So do you know how growth weight stuff works? Is it like literally like Ross's 50% strength plus the hero's 30% uh, strength makes it a 80%? That can't be right. HP is 75 plus 70. No, that that's not right, is it? That can't be right. Okay, hold on. Let me... Like, I don't fully understand how this works. I'm also looking at, like, promotion gain... The gains we get from promoting to... A fighter versus a pirate. Uh, we get... Are they all the same? It looks like HP, strength, and skill are going to be the same no matter which one we choose. In terms of the stat bonus we get right away. It's a plus one HP, plus two strength and skill no matter which one we choose. It looks like fighter... Gets a free plus one speed. Zero luck. Zero defense. One res. 
And then there's a three and one here. I think that's uh, con and movement, yeah. Plus three con, plus one movement. The pirate, however, does not get a point in speed. It does get one point in luck, which means it's more likely to get a crit once we get there eventually. Plus one defense, no res, plus two con, plus one movement. Yeah. Okay. I think we can rule out Warrior. As high as stat rates overall. Yeah, that yeah, I remember that. Honestly, I think we can rule out Warrior. I am wondering if the crit is going to matter, is going to give us a lot more out of it than the swords. Plus, we'll have more strength. But we're going to be lacking in speed. Okay, chat. Hero or Berserker? What is our end goal? I think we can rule out warrior. Let me look at growth rates for the berserker. Let's see. 50% strength boost versus heroes 30. 25 speed growth, though, versus the hero's 20. Wait, that's not right. 25, 25 speed percent speed growth. Hero has 20. Huh. However, I think uh, the hero can have a higher stat cap, 26 speed 20 28 speed maximum stats really it seems to be that the berser the berserker might be the best option maybe what's what's our strength cap 30 for berserker 25 the berserker has a higher it seems to have a higher strength cap as well as a higher speed cap and the hero's boost, assuming it's additive, right? Because I don't fully know how the growth rate stuff works. It has a 20% speed growth in hero, while Berserker has a 20, uh, has a 25. So the Berserker has a higher chance of boosting speed. 30 strength from the hero, 50 strength from the Berserker. It seems like for what we need, the Berserker ha has more attack and speed growth. Let me look at uh, 20 defense, 10 res. Okay, we get less defense and res, and I think that's the trade-off. 15 luck. Uh, yeah, versus 25 luck, but the Berserker already makes up for that with the... the the plus 15 crit, no matter what. Skill. 30 skill for hero. 35 skill for the Berserker. Honestly, I think the Berserker is just the better option. I think we are better off with the Berserker. We have a higher strength cap and a higher speed cap with the Berserker. We have a, as far as I can tell, we have a higher chance to get both those stats. Because uh, those are probably going to be the most important things. We have less defense, but... And then, like... We have a higher chance of luck. 
No, we have less of a higher chance of getting luck. What's Ross's base luck growth? 40, so we get a 55 from the Berserker? Yeah, we get a 55. But then, but even though we get less luck boosts from the Berserker, that plus 15 crit will make up for it. I think we are better off with the Berserker. I think we should go Berserker. I'm assuming I'm doing the growth rate stuff correctly. I'm assuming that's right. Because, uh... And even if it's not correct... I always make him Berserker or Warrior. Yeah, I, I, I think Berserker is the best option right now. I think that is what we should do. And being able to go over mountains and see can maybe help with the niche. Um, yeah. We're locked to axes. But I think we can make up for that. So... Yeah. We want to be the pirate. Sorry, that took a while, but... Really had to think that through. That's real... This is going to be the main thing we're going to be thinking about whenever we get a class change. A lot of sword users to get later on. That is true. HP... Yeah. That is also true. Because we have Joshua, who will might be good. We might need to give him some strength, but we're going to get Raven, another hero. Like, those two are probably going to be our main sword units. Uh, Bench Seth, have Joshua. I think we're going to use this team for now. Ross! Oh, Ross can finally do things. Now he can keep up with everyone else more efficiently. He's now, he's not a trainee anymore. Sorry that took a while. Oh, am I thinking, is Raven, Raven's FE7. I, I always get some of these confused. Who am I thinking of? I am thinking of Garrick. That's who I'm thinking of. My bad. Yeah, Raven's FE7. Garrick is the one I'm thinking of. All right. Now, with that all taken care of, we need to get these these three saved. Uh, all we need to do is... Just... We don't need to talk to them or anything. I think we just need to make sure they're just safe. If all the civilians... If all three of the them are saved, we get an Orion's Bolt. Which means we can promote Naimi if we want to. Or any other archer. Okay. There's nothing... I don't think we get anything for... Saving every village. We just get the item from there. Uh, okay. So, we can try having Vanessa rush in and try to get over here as much as fast as possible, but she's probably just going to be rushing into danger. Uh, what to do? We need to get someone over here. What's everyone's level? Uh, I can't really check from here, can I? Six. Well, I don't really care. Five, ten, three. Well, now you're back to one. Five, five, three. Everyone's kind of... other. France is very high level. And even though Ross is back down to one... I think his stats are now better. Yeah. Franz is basically level 11. Or, Ross is basically level 11. 
Franz and Ross are my strongest units, so like everyone else kind of needs to be worked on. Hmm, what to do? Let's have uh, formation. Let's have Joshua go here. We'll have Joshua go straight ahead. I think. We'll have Arter go south. We'll have Franz go north. No. Ross is not needed. Something like this, maybe? Yeah, I am not sure what route to go, because I don't remember everything where everyone is. I think this will work. Let's start with getting Joshua to that fort. We'll have Erica go south. With Arthur and Naomi. Oh, this would have been a good idea to bring the torch. I could use the torch, not a torch staff. Alright. France goes north. Yeah, you just have an iron sword. Good, you have the lance equipped. Uh, we'll send... Hold on. What's your range? Okay. Go here, I guess. Send her up. Send Mulder over here. He might go up. Natasha, you go over here. And Ross, you follow. I forget where all the formations are set up. Yeah, I knew that wasn't going to take do much. So I'm thinking we have loot maybe grab that kill or something. And then have Ross stand, have Joshua stand on the fort. Yeah, Vanessa's far behind in levels. <sighs> that whole thing's blocked off. Yeah, we'll probably use Garrick and Joshua. I mean, we're forced to use Erica, though. I forget what our final team count is going to be, but I think we'll probably bench Naomi eventually, because archers are not that great, and, and Inez is probably a better one. Okay. Oh, you're getting healed. So yeah, it's good to know we can make it through... Uh, we can make it through, uh, Ephraim's chapter. That's good to know. Let's throw you here. Let's have you go down. Uh, maybe we can have Naomi... No. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna have Ross get rid of this guy. I know he's a little overpowered. But what we can do is we can have Joshua stand right here. Thinking about it, we are. I think our best shot is to probably use uh, Amelia and oh, what's his name? Here, get rid of that. Uh, e uh, Elwin, Ewan. Just the fact that they get the extra level ups from the, those extra what nine level ups. I think that will pay off a lot more. Um, oh, what to do? Can you get on the mountain? No, you can't. We could KO you. We could KO you with Franz. Alright, you know, I think we can make this work.
magic speed and luck. Okay. Then we get rid of you. Franz is gonna need healing. Probably loot as well. Strength, skill, speed, and luck. Very good. Oh, uh, what to do here? What to do? I think we need to back out. Let Vanessa get attacked by this guy. We're gonna heal. Assuming you will even go after Vanessa. They'll probably go after Joshua or Ross. Oh, I might go after Erica. That might have been a mistake. Who's left? Holder. Okay, we can stand here. Yeah, I was worried about that. We're gonna have to have Ross take care of him. Oh, good. You're being a dodge tank. You might have to have them use a vulnerary. Wait, he doesn't have one, does he? Thanks, Joshua. Okay, there's a lot of armor units here. A lot of armor units here. Really, which one is that? We might have to have Ross take care of this, or we can. Yeah, we'll, I think we'll, we'll reset, okay. Switch having an advertising problem where they can't get any of their ads. I mean, if, maybe, because every time I like boot up Twitch, I get the same ads too. Yeah, like I get that travel one. Uh, there's like this, what is it, a Modern Warfare 3 one that I don't care about. There, there's just a few stuff. And you constantly see the same stuff in the same order. I forget them all. After a while, I just kind of mute and just focus on other things. We're not really going to use Naomi. Uh, I'm going to have uh, Vanessa grab the torch. There we go. Alright, let's get Ross on the fort. Torch. There, that's a little bit better. We could probably get Joshua right here to deal with this guy. Put Arter around here. Have Erica go to the village. There we go. Have Luke go up here. Same thing with Mulder. Something like that. Ross is doing a better job. Yeah, thinking about it, we're probably going to use the training units. Those nine extra levels are probably going to help them. Okay. 
Oh, I didn't know you were in range. Uh, Franz is fine. He's fine. Okay. They're fine. We're gonna get Ross right on the fort. So he should deal with armor units as they pop up. This should weaken him just enough. Let's have Vanessa actually. Okay, wait. Joshua, get this KO. Okay. Ah, oh, Naomi, you were like, you were so close. All right, we're gonna do this. Runs down here. You could theoretically attack Vanessa. Ah, ooh, okay. Let's get Vanessa healed. Okay. So you get closer. What about you? No. Can you KO? Yeah. Then what we could do is have you... You won't get a kill. You would've if Mulder was in the way. Or in range, I should say. Luke got a little bit of speed. Okay. Friends, I could really use a crit right now. That would be very nice. No, of course not. <laughs> of course you don't get a crit. What's your range? Yeah, okay. Molder better go here and back off. Yeah, I had a feeling he'd go after Joshua. Mulder's being a good dodge tank right now. Good, we put Ross in a better spot. I usually always make Ross a berserker, but I was really like, is this really the best option? But it kind of seems that way for this challenge. Good, we dodged the poison axe. Uh, what do we get? Strength, skill, and speed. That is exactly what we need. <laughs> yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. If I heal Vanessa, I could just give her this kill. But I could also just hand it to Jos Joshua. I could maybe give Vanessa that kill up there. Oh, there's so many other guys, though. Yeah. Okay. The spider's not there yet. Let's see. Joshua could go up and take down this guy, but we're still... Ross needs to take down this, uh, the armor unit. I can have Naomi get rid of this guy. Let's have Ross get rid of the armor unit. That's gonna be the biggest problem. I can have Joshua run up. 
and get rid of this guy. I can have Vanessa fly up. Get rid of you? Uh, we risk getting hit. I don't like the odds, but... Yeah, I knew it. Speed and defense, okay. We got an iron blade. Wait, it is an... Wait. Do we count iron blades? They are iron. They are stronger and more heavy, but... Do they, they should count this challenge, right? Or do we specifically want it only iron swords? Leave that up to you. I heard there are monstrous spiders living in the mountains to the east. They said to be poisonous, so I stocked up on antitoxins. This antitoxin stuff's strong stuff. No need to worry about poison with this around. Hey, why don't you go ahead and take one? Go ahead, you may need it. They might still eat you, but at least they won't be able to poison you. We just picked up an iron blade. Do we count this? They are both iron, but... This is a D rank weapon. It is stronger, but it's more heavy and less accuracy, but it is an iron weapon, technically. Do we count it? Let's have you grab this kill. Um, it is allowed. Okay, we can use iron blades. That gives us A option, but granted, I think iron swords are generally better, but having the extra strength from an iron blade might be helpful. Uh, let's get Vanessa healed. And we gotta hope that Joshua dodges some attacks. Can you? Yeah, okay. So we can have Fran stand. Uh, do this. He is standing on a mountain tile. What do we got, Franz? Strength, speed, luck, and defense. Good. Let Mulder stand there. Okay. Honestly, I think Vanessa needs to come up here. Get rid of someone. And that someone has to be this guy. Joshua's in danger, too. Okay, we lucked out. Oh, we need distinctions for spells because they don't have an iron thing. Iron blade is still iron. Ma yeah, I was just making sure. Because I completely forget. Strength, skill, and speed. That's good. Because I could completely forget about iron blade weapons. Because I never use them. I, I never like the drawbacks. And loot's dead. Oh no, my keyboard fell.
I still think putting Ross on the fort is a good idea. I needed to make sure Mulder just wasn't in range in that first attack. That would have made things a little bit easier. There shouldn't be a reason for France to swap to Iron Stuff. Or Iron Sword, I should say. Keep the Lance equipped. Put you here. Okay. Use the torch. She's only going to get attacked by one of them. Go here. Try to get you closer. Get you closer. I think Erica's the only one that's going to go for the antitoxin. Everyone else is going to go above the village. Isn't the boss to the northwest or the s or not west? Is the boss to the northeast or the southeast? I think he's to the southeast. Got an iron blade. Yeah, we could KO him with loot. But now, that, since this guy isn't attacking Mulder, we could do the same thing. Now, one thing we're going to have to consider is, do we want to go Paladin or do we want to go Great Knight? Normally, I go with Paladin, but maybe we need the pure strength of Great Knight. I don't know. We'll find out when we... We'll figure it out when we get to that point. But it makes me wonder what's the better, what's going to be the better option. Magic and luck. Let's have you get rid of this guy. Good. Doing a little bit better. Strength, speed, and luck. All right, we'll take it. Down here, we can have Naomi weaken it down, weaken him down to ten. Won't be enough for Vanessa to KO. We'll have Al Arter attack. Now Vanessa can get the KO. There we go. Perfect. Now we have Joshua go here. Not enough to KO. He's gonna go after, be able to go after Vanessa anyway. And I'm not far enough in range. All right, so. Yeah, let's... I don't like those odds. Let's go here. Of course. Joshua has to be able to dodge something. Make sure Vanessa is at full health. Don't, uh... Sorry. Uh, Mermid Mermidans get, like, a plus crit rate. Not Mermidans, but uh, sword fighters. Yeah, they do get crit rates. Do that, or they could be an assassin. With the silencer skill, I think we're... 
better off with the Swordmaster. A plus crit rate will be useful. Come on, Ross, you gotta dodge a lot of things. You're not necessarily a tank, but you're the best one we got right now. If I wanted a tank, I would have brought Seth. Skill? Eh, could be better. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if we're going to end up using Vanessa or maybe Tana, but we're definitely going to want... Uh, we're definitely going to want a flyer on our team. At least one. Well, we'll probably end up using... Uh, what's his name? Cormag, yeah. The Wyvern Rider eventually. Maybe that will be our only flyer. is doing a lot better. But I didn't realize there was a mage right there. Okay. Shashua needs healing. Vanessa also needs healing. Arthur has a better shot to KO this soldier. Uh, this uh, mage. Oh, we can't reach him. Let's have Naomi take down this guy. Yeah, if we're gonna have a bow user with us, we'll probably have Inez. Now that we have this... Not enough. Not enough. Oh, that was a mistake. have France take down this or weaken this archer, I guess. This guy may go after loot, but loot can probably dodge. Alright, I have to make a decision. You can't KO either. I would have to use two people. If I want to get rid of this guy, I need to use two people. I didn't know he was this. This guy was here. Um. I don't like those odds, and I didn't even hit him last time. this idea. And I can't have you get close either. We can, we can stand there, but... I see another death.
it's not going to be Ross. Yeah, I had a feeling he'd do that. Uh, loot, you can't double. Dang it. At least we were in the forest for that one. But then there's this. Come on, Naomi. You gotta dodge. And nope. Uh... Honestly, we would have been fine if I didn't bring out the Dark Mage. I didn't I didn't know he was there. There's reinforcements from the back. So if I don't stand here, we'll be good. Oh, I should have checked the see what was what that was in the fog. Alright, time to try this again. So, don't... Don't stand here. No. Stay there, I guess. Ross going up, going over there is not an issue. Franz going up here is not an issue. Neither is Loot or Molder. Erica going down to the village is not an issue. Maybe we should have Molder help heal with everyone else. We could hold off on going to the fort right away. That would stop the one sword guy for a little bit. At least one extra turn. That could be a problem. Okay. You blame loot? She didn't do anything. She didn't do anything. And is that why you blame her? Because she didn't do anything? I think I don't think that helped. All right. Ah, that's a little bit better. For Prodigy, she's not doing much. I mean, once she gets, like, a little bit more speed, she can start doubling. Once she's able to double. Again, I like my mages. <laughs> In most Fire Emblem games, I usually like having mage. Uh, I usually really like my mages. We got magic and speed. That's a really good level. Let's get rid of you. Franz is going to need healing. But we can't have Mulder go and heal him right now. Speed and luck? Okay. Could use better stuff, but... Yeah. What? Let's see. Let's weaken this guy with Archer. It's too bad we don't get a Ewain for a while. Ah, come on. I can't stand here. 
Can Namie? No. Okay. I think we are better off just standing here. Hmm. Give Natasha some EXP. What's your range? Okay. They're not gonna move unless I get close enough. Let's have Ross stay here for one more turn, right? I think that might be the good idea. See what happens. Uh, friends, you're gonna need some healing. Yeah, they didn't move. He didn't move either. Why? Am I not in his range? Well, what we can do now is give Vanessa this kill. She doesn't need any healing. HP, strength, and skill. Good. Let's heal Joshua. Ugh. Oh, come on, Natasha. You need one more. Wait. Let's move Joshua one square up. Erica goes here, gets the antitoxin. Let's go here. Now we have Roscoe here. Up here, let's see. We get rid of the archer. And let's leave loot right here. Let's leave Mulder right there. Let's see how this works. We delay these enemy reinforcements for a little bit. For one turn. That I think that helps. We were getting we were being attacked by too many enemies. That extra turn to be able to heal. Uh, not have too many units with low health, you know, I think that's gonna help. Okay. Skill and defense. Okay. Okay. This guy is actually going to be a major problem. Yeah, I knew you were going to go after loot. And again, we can't double. That sucks. At least we got rid of the archer. Okay, reinforcements. Let's have Franz. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, I have to have Franz do this. If Luke could double. Or have more magic, but she needed to double. There we go. 
Now we can go heal Franz. Down here, let's see. We need to be able to get rid of him. Let's have Ross get rid of the this guy. Okay. If I am correct, this guy is going to run away so he could try to get healed by this uh, Trabadour. Which that will help me. Uh, we need to get rid of this guy. I want Archer right here. You have 11 health. Okay. I still want Archer right here. We're gonna give him this kill. Arthur should now be in range of the Dark Mage. We now need to get rid of this guy. He might run away. We need to have Naomi weaken this guy. Good. We have Vanessa grab the kill. We have a better shot. Then we can have Joshua in the forest. Or we we can just have Joshua get the kill. I know there's another axe unit up here somewhere. If we do this. We can get the kill, but we are risking getting attacked. Level five. Level four. What's your defense? Seven and five. You both have the same defense. Uh, don't know why my nose like itches. It's like the edge of my nose too. It's kind of annoying. Set you here. Anyone need healing? Let's have Erica go back here. Okay. He's being distracted by Naomi. That might help me. Because he didn't have good accuracy anyway. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. I should have kept him in the forest. Okay, you went after Vanessa. I'm actually kind of surprised. Okay. Only five damage, but I will double. So it won't KO, but it'll get close. We get a speed. I mean, that's not what we need. Is Mulder gonna die? Okay, good. Okay, let's give that at least put her on the forest tile. Skill and res. I think those are the only reinforcements. Okay. You can't double, which means you can't KO. You can't KO that guy. 
You can KO this guy. That's good. Friends, what are we looking at? Speed and defense? Well, at least you're more tanky. Okay. Oh, you can't get to a forest tile. We gotta use a Vulnary. Okay. Now down here... Can we have Erica get rid of this guy? No! You only deal one damage. Let's first have Archer get rid of this guy. The armor unit. Too bad Ross cannot make it to the... The reinforcement. Joshua, what are we looking at? Four damage, not enough. Namie. Can't even double. Vanessa? I did not think this guy would be a problem. We can't make it either. There's too many guys here. Skill and res, okay. More accuracy. We got a halberd, we can't use it. We can't use that halberd. God, I don't know why my nose is itchy. Okay. I think we can maybe ignore this guy. I'm sorry. I No, not allergies. It's just a little bit itchy on the side. I don't think I have any allergies. Or if I do, I don't know what they are. Oh, what to do? Um... This may sound weird. But I think we might need to ignore the cav unit for a second. Of course you don't deal enough damage. Okay. I think we might need to ignore the cav. Um... I think we need to ignore you. I do think we need to get rid of you. This guy. Ugh. Naomi's gonna get attacked. Uh, no, Natasha's gonna get attacked by like two people. Oh, I don't like this. Sadly, though, I th there's nothing we can do. I Naomi can't KO this guy, and even if she could, she'll get attacked. Erica is going to, like, only, can only deal one damage. So we can't go in for the KO. I think we should have Naomi run back here. We have Natasha run over here. Have Erica run into this woods. 
Luckily we healed. Luckily we healed Molder. Good. We gotta get Vanessa over there soon. You can't KO. But... Ross can. If he hits both times. Good. It's one guy out of here. We can't... I think we can have Vanessa start going over here. You deal 11 damage. He has no range. He got rid of the javelin. Okay. We can maybe make this work. Start weakening this guy. Naomi, come on. Uh, you only deal one damage. Okay. You go over here. You go over here. What are we looking at? We'll be fine. much health. We'll leave Erica here. Up here. We need to have Franz get this KO. 714. You know what? We don't need to have Franz get the KO. We just needed to have Franz hit him once. Then we can have loot. Grab the KO. It was a little risky. Because... Uh, loot doesn't have the best accuracy. Skill and speed. Good. Now we can heal Franz. Okay. I'm gonna need to heal him another time, but... Okay, let's have Vanessa run out, start flying over here. Really focusing on the healer. There he is. There's the spider. And Vanessa, where are we looking at? Skill, speed, luck. I don't think that's what we need, Vanessa. Ugh. Okay. We got a javelin, too. We gotta get to that spider. Uh, she'll be attacked by the javelin guy. Actually, if we go right here, we won't be. However, we do need to use the Volunary. Okay. Now, down here... Myrmidon, uh, five. Let's not... Let's try not to use Ross. Arter? Maybe we'll give the kill to Arter. Oh, you're level six. Nah, yeah. We'll give it... We'll hand it to Arter. Okay. Joshua will have better chances some other time. Ross, you need to start heading that way. Same thing with Joshua. We need to heal Joshua.
Yeah, we'll have Erica just follow. Naomi, sure, just follow with, with them. Let's work on the Iron Sword, I guess. Wait, uh, how well can loot do? Get rid of the healer. Perfect. Got an elixir. Heal Franz. I'm just trying to remember where the boss is actually located. We shouldn't get attacked by the armor unit. Yeah, oh, it's poison. If I get hit, that's not good. But I do need to, I need to attack. Maybe I should. Okay, we lucked out. I was thinking maybe I should have healed. We won't really be able to save them if Vanessa can't defeat the spider. Go here. Josh will fall behind. Alright, well, let's just move forward a bit. All we need to do is defeat the boss. So maybe we can just try to find him. Okay, you're gonna focus on Vanessa. That's actually pretty good. If that's the only spider, we can make this work. And that is exactly why I put Erica on the forest tile. Alright. Roscoe over here. Alright. You're weakened. Can we give the KO to someone else? Erica, what can you do? Zero damage, I figured. Joshua? Not enough. Let's at least put you in a forest tile. Right, up here. Upper right? I had a feeling. I kind of wish Franz had the torch. And I can't use the torch staff. The problem is I don't know where he's at. He's probably in here. No! Wait. He's gotta be in here. Who's left over? Erica? Stay. We're gonna have Vanessa just wait. Let the spider attack me. Because if we get hit, I could just use a Volinary. Honestly, all we need to do is just distract the spider. There's a Thunder Tome user. Uh, heal staff. Dang it. Okay. Arter? 
Can you get the KO? You can. And with a crit, too. Arthur's getting some EXP. Skill, luck, res. Okay. Kind of wish he had magic or speed, but okay. What about Joshua? No, you can't get the KO. But we can weaken him with Erica. All of our use six. Okay, we'll we'll give the KO to Joshua. This. We got HP and strength. That's good. He, he's gonna need strength. Um. Honestly, we're not gonna make it to Vanessa. We can rescue though. We could have Ross... Eh. Honestly, we're probably better off just letting Vanessa handle this. Can you KO? No. Yeah, we can KO. Let's use their iron sword. More accuracy, and... I don't know. Just using the iron sword. Okay, I still don't know where he's at. I really need him healed. <laughs> you wait. There's only one spider, right? You know, no, we'll have Ross go over here and maybe help out. Or try to, even if it's just rescuing. Honestly, Vanessa just stalling the spider is good enough. She's getting rep weapon levels, not that it matters. He's over here. He's gonna be a mage. There he is. Okay. He has flux. Well, we were just out of his range, I see. Arthur is probably gonna help out. Get Mulder healed. There we go. Eh, close enough. Keep you right here. If you wait. Oh, what's the best way to do this. I could have Vanessa rescue the kid, then fly away. But we can only do that once the others are safe. Oh, I didn't know there was a spear guy here. Don't tell me our... our turn. No. The boss isn't moving. Well, that's useful. What are we dealing with damage here? He could deal eight. I could deal eight as well. 
level six, level six. Um, let's try. Good. HP and skill. More accuracy, but you really need strength. Okay. Arter needs some healing. We can put Arter in Namie's spot. Put you here, get Mulder down here. If I went in for the attack, he could deal 12 damage, I can only deal 2. If Naomi wants to attack, she would have to go, like, right here. Or here. What level are you now? 7? Okay. What's going on down here? Oh, we got a crit! Oh, Vanessa's almost got this. But she's probably not going to get the kill in time. Alright. Arter. What are we looking at here? I mean... It's just... If he's not going to move... Erica can stay there. At least put him on the forest tile. What's the spider gonna do? Okay, good. We still haven't gotten poisoned. We saved them. But we safe. Okay, you're not moving at all. No, it can't be. They made it this far. <sighs> Must I do everything myself? I knew she could survive at one hit. For whatever reason, he's not moving. The kids should be fine. We can have Vanessa start flying this way. Alright, next. Erica, you need to back out. You need to heal Erica. I like how Ephraim took over a castle with four units, but in the end he did it with one sword among four men. Yeah, exactly. It's just like, not only did I take over your castle, I did it with an even bigger handicap. How do you like that, Volter? Yeah. It's not much, but it's better. If he doesn't move, then Erica will be safe. We can have you here. Ooh, I don't like that. What about Joshua? I like those odds. Alright, Joshua's getting a KO. Alright, uh, is this the end? No fame. No glory.
There we go. I like to see another protag do that. You're safe now. I'm so scared. I was so scared. So very, very scared. Thank you. You save us both. If you would, you save us both, implying that the husband was never there. If you'd like, please take this. And thanks you again. We got the Orion's bolt. Your late father, King Fado, he ordered me to keep the keep silent till the proper time arrived. However, with all that has happened, with Emperor Vigard's actions, I feel it is imperative that I tell you everything, Princess Erica. Then why do the whole "I'll tell you later when time is right"? It was like the difference of one chapter, or at least one chapter for Erica. Are you ready to hear the secret of the bracelet you wear? I am. As you know, Princess, Renee's houses houses one of the legendary sacred stones. Of course, it's in the temple. It's supposed to ward against evil. Yes, the true stone is, but the stone in the temple is nothing but a forgery. The real sacred stone of Renee lies beneath the royal castle. Guarding it is a powerful seal on an infinitely complex lock of sorts. What? Is, that, is this true? Yes. King Fado confided in me himself. Sacred stones banish evil long ago and possesses powers beyond our kin. And it, the ancient kings of Rene fell, it was prudent to seal ours away. They feared its power could be misused. They uh, they taught to remove they thought to remove the temptation. The keys to break the seal were hidden too, forged into bracelets. The very ones that you and your brother, Prince Ephraim, wear. Our bracelets? How could Father keep this a secret from me for so long? They must know nothing of the bracelets. Tell them only of some great peril strikes. Those were King Father's exact words. Prince Ephraim knows nothing of the bracelet's secret either. The king told me this out of fear that something might happen to him. So that, when the time came, the two of you could learn the truth. The bracelets have such meaning. Yes. And we are the only living souls who know about the secret of the Stone of Rene. At least, that's what I was given to believe. And yet... Yet the Grotto Army has made it clear that they want me only for the bracelet. Yes, it's clear that... I don't know how, but Emperor Vigard must have learned the secret somehow. And now his troops pr pursue the bracelet, and we are no longer to knowing his motives. Or, no closer to knowing his motives. He, uh, he would use the bracelets to unlock the sacred stone and destroy it in secret. Perhaps. Which means that my brother, and his bracelet, if he's been captured, then they may have the bracelet already. already. And he may be... Ephraim... Princess, we must take Novala's word to be true. We must hurry to Prince Ephraim. The enemy soldiers who fled the battle will have reported our location by now. If the prince is being held prisoner at Renval, I fear they might execute him once they learn of our approach. You're right. We have no time to waste. We must hurry to Renval. Let's go rescue my brother. There were soldiers that escaped. I mean, there's Renval. Uh, let's look at our items. First, we'll put these in storage. We don't, I don't even think we can use their Ryan's Bolt yet, even if we wanted to. Yeah, we can't use it. Uh, you're fine on healing staffs. You're fine on lightning. You're fine on healing. Iron Blade, that can go to... It's either Joshua or Erica. Let's just do that for now. You're fine on the Iron Lance. We don't need the Torch. You do that. We'll, we're going to save our sec secret books and dragon shields and all that stuff for later. When we know we need it. So the elixir in there. Sell the halberd. There we go. You don't need a new axe. You don't need a new bow. You don't need fire. I 
kept forgetting to give you a vulnerary. Does anyone else need a vulnerary? I mean, Ross could use one soon, but he's fine. I think we're fine on weapons and items. We might give the Iron Blade to... Well, we could hand it to Franz, or we could hand it to Joshua. But for now, I'll let Erica hang on to it. What's your attack power? Five? Ugh. I think Erica is just going to be dead weight for a lot of this. I know Erica had this problem. She just has no strength to really do anything. She has the speed, but when she deals zero damage, what does it matter? Alright, well, we don't need anything. We don't have access to the tower, Ronnie. So, mm -hmm. with how long that took, I don't know how long Renval is going to take. Uh, I think I'm going to wrap it up here. We only really did two chapters, but... Oh, you know, kind of interesting, I guess. I Yeah, I think I'm going to wrap it up. Thanks for everyone who showed up. I'm doing these streams Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. If you want to see the old streams that are not on Twitch anymore, they're on YouTube at scottbot 64 Stream Archives. Uh, you know, let's see. Is anyone playing Sacred Stones? I keep forgetting to do this. Let's see if anyone is. Uh, let's see. Good. Uh, there's a couple people. Oh, let me... Let me figure it out. Secret stones. Alright, uh... Let's go raid... This person. We'll get that going. Well... While we get that going, uh, I'll see you next week for more of this. Have a good day. Later.